Good afternoon, UCF Knights. I'm Julia Anderson, and this is what's happening today, Thursday, February 6, 2014. The UCF football team now has 17 new players. The Knights signed 17 recruits yesterday during National Signing Day. Nine, Coach George O'Leary announced the recruits at a news conference eight. yesterday. The Knights signed three four-star players, Kyle Gibson, defensive back from Tampa, Tyler Harris, quarterback from Blackshear, Georgia, and Chris Williams, defensive back from St. Mary's, Georgia. Coach O'Leary thinks this is a good-looking class of 2014. There are probably more UCF students using food stamps than you might think. A study published by the University of Maine revealed that since 2001, the number of college students using food stamps has more than doubled. An organization on campus helps struggling students who don't qualify for food stamps. But even this organization is having a hard time making ends meet. Tomorrow on the Nightly Newscast, reporter Sarah Smith talks with one student who tells us why she relies on food stamps. It's almost apartment hunting season, and we found a way to make it a lot easier. UCF Party UCF Tutor UCF. creator and UCF alumnus Brent <laughs> Henderson recently launched ApartmentTutor.com. Some of the features on the website include rates, distance from UCF, and amenities offered. Henderson says the Party Tutor app has over 50,000 downloads, and he's hoping for the same reaction with Apartment Tutor. The website just launched last Thursday, and you can find the link on nightlynews.ucf.edu. Don't leave the house without your umbrellas today. There's a 50% chance of rain, and you might want to grab a sweater as well because it's not going to get any warmer. The high is only 66 with a low of 54. Now tomorrow temperatures will go back up into the 70s, but we're still looking at a 40% chance of rain. The rest of the weekend looks similar with highs in the 70s, lows in the 60s, and a 30 to 50 percent chance of rain. That's all the time we have for today. Thanks for joining us. Be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter for more updates from the Nightly Newsroom. Have a great day.